Friends, the people have given their verdict. In all humility, we respect the verdict. A new government will be formed. We extend to them our good wishes and offer them our construct. We hope the basic principles of our nationhood, democracy, secularism, socialism, and non-alignment will be maintained. As I demit office, I wish to thank the people of India for the affection that they have showered upon me in such abundance. During these last five years, I have been amongst our people from the farthest and the remotest reaches of our land to places of more ready access. Everywhere, I have seen a great India being built by a great people. The accomplishments of our nation building are the achievements of our people. Elections are won and lost, but the work of a nation never ends. We shall not falter in our resolve to do our duty by India. I and millions of Congress workers rededicate ourselves to the cause of India's greatness. Mahatma Gandhi ji and Indira ji laid down their lives for the unity and integrity of India, for secularism in India. India cannot survive without secularism. We will do everything to uphold secular values. With all my strength, I shall continue to serve the people of India. My best wishes to you all. Jai Hind. Thank you. सत्ताईस को हमारा जलसा और आप तशीब आ रहे होंगे ना वहाँ ना समझे निशान बुलाया कल पर तो तो हमको दो चार लोगों को भेजना अच्छा उस तरफ हमें सत्ताईस दूसरी बारिश थी मध्य प्रदेश कांग्रेस कमेटी में भी हमारे मध्य प्रदेश से कोई नुमाइन नहीं है पहले आपने फरमाया था क्या करने का अभी ऐसे सारे सामने इस्तीफा दे दिया अभी इस तरह सामने इस्तीफा दे दिया और बदनामी किया उन्होंने और लोग भी लड़ाई झगड़ा करने छोड़ दें हमारे देखिए बराबर काम जो किस तरफ से देख लेगा इसे भी I am here on behalf of President George Bush and the American people to express our grief at the assassination of Ravji Gandhi. I met, first met Ravji Gandhi in 1985 at a private luncheon after he had spoken to the joint session of Congress. I was impressed at that time with his commitment to democracy. He was determined to bring economic and social development to India. He represented a new generation of leadership in the world. Uh, I mean, I'm going to